Hi, I'm Chris Bird from the Bird's Eye View. Just got done watching um, Andre Berto, Robert the Ghost Guerrero. Breaking down this fight, after the fight, smart game plan from Robert the Ghost Guerrero. I look at the fight starting off. Berto got the speed, the power, the athleticism. Robert the Ghost Guerrero, just a great game plan. Like he said after the fight, put the pressure on. That's what he did. Smothered him. Made him fight his fight. It kind of reminds you of John Ruiz when he was heavyweight champion. Fought similar. Everybody say he was jab and grab, but he was heavyweight, two-time heavyweight champion because of his style. Smart game plan. He, he smothered the, the speedster, smothered the power, and he became the power puncher in the fight. And, and I look at the corners. What were they telling Berto? You know, I'm looking at the fight as a, a skilled guy myself as a boxer with, with uh, speed and elusiveness. I had big heavyweights pushing me to the, to the ropes. The point is, throw combinations, throwing uppercuts, certain punches you throw, and then you use your legs to get out. Berto never got out. I don't know if the corner was telling him that or not. If they were, you know, shame on Berto. If they wasn't, shame on the corner. But a great win for, for Robert the Ghost Guerrero, and he goes on to bigger fights. Smart game plan. He's going to be a guy hard to beat, left-handed, can crack a little bit, but has a smart corner. Win fights like that. Put, putting on pressure, making you fight his fight. So check me out every Thursday on, on the Bird's Eye View, and I'll see you later.